Hello and welcome to this video. My name is, as you may or may not know, Hayden McLennan and this video is the office slash room slash desk tour for 2016. So I do one of these every year and it's finally time and it's finally that time of year to do a room slash desk slash office tour. Uh, I've done I've done one every year uh, around about the same time ever since I moved into this place and like I said it's time to do this one. So here is me from earlier in the week, uh, I hope you enjoy it. So it's about time for the room tour for 2016. So as always we're studying in the office part of my room because I am in a sleep out with two rooms and uh, let's start from this side over here. So over here we just have the uh, one of the lights, there are two lights. Uh, and I use them for uh, just liking me when I'm sitting in uh, over there. So, or uh, indeed over here with the overhead camera, uh, which is what I've been doing a lot recently. Now down here we just have a bag over there. Here we have uh, my collection of Ethernet switches. This one still needs to go into a radio station in Roxburgh. Uh, that's just down, uh, down from me, about half an hour away from me. Uh, this is one that I need to sell. I think I'll sell it for 120 bucks because it was only used for three months and it still has a two-year warranty on it. Uh, well, or well, two and a bit years. Uh, this is a spare switch just in case my uh, my main one dies. Uh, here's a lap couple of laptop bags and a tool kit thing. There's a really old laptop in one of those. Uh, over here we just have a couple of weights and here we have my collection of keyboards, spare keyboards. Uh, we have my tripod right here with my uh, air conditioner remote on it because when it's sitting in its holder over there it um, doesn't, uh, it can't talk to that uh, to turn it off with the timer. Uh, we just have a spare ethernet uh, jack outlet thingy over there. We have a spare heater. I would normally use the heat pump in winter because it's a lot more energy efficient. Uh, here we just have a spare chair. Uh, that was the middle between that chair and that chair which I'll get to later. Over here we just have the uh, wall mount bracket for my cabinet just in case it was going to go on a wall. A uh, spare pillow and a piece of dowel or oh, piece of wood. <laughs> Uh, we also have my printer right here with uh, some paper on it. It needs uh, new ink, so what I think I'll do is I'll just buy a laser printer. And um, yeah, because the toner works out to be cheaper than the ink, even though the outlay is more expensive. So uh, down here we have my network cabinet that's sitting there all nice and tidily from the last time I showed you. I'm not going to show you uh, today because that means we'd have to pull that and stuff. So here's my laptop, it has a 120 gig SSD and Intel Celeron processor, uh, no graphics card and it also has 6 gig RAM. Uh, down there is a full power bar which is relatively dangerous. The blue uh, ethernet cable there is the internet in from the house which you can see in the network, network tour video. Uh, here is the left side of my desk with, uh, this is just my snap on screwdriver so I can get to it easily. Uh, this is a spit cloth, this is a dusting cloth, and I also have a collection of screwdrivers under there with um, some spare paper for the printer over there. Uh, this is the case for my microphone and stuff. Uh, this, These are spare uh, containers for storing things, and I'll show you the shelf where they would go uh, soon. And in here is just some stuff. Uh, here is just, you know, it's getting into summer. <laughs> Uh, down here is the power bar for my desk setup. Uh, and coming up here, we have some spare video equipment. We have the uh, back two channels of my speakers, speaker system for the desk. Here we have the Network Plus Guide to Networks 2009, 5th fifth, fifth edition. They call it the 5th edition, it's from 2009. Uh, back there is my wireless access point. Here is my uh, bike helmet and here is just a spare USB A to B cable. Here is the left channel of my speaker system. Uh, what else? Uh, spare bits and pieces over here, spare chip of RAM, uh, spare cabinet bolts, uh, case for my H4N recorder, uh, my wallet and keys, coaster, uh, pad for writing down the times I use that which I enter into an Excel spreadsheet. Um, the controller for my speaker system. This uh, just controls the volume and whether it 
uh, whether it's all mono, so whether it comes out of all of them or is stereo, and uh, the on and off button, and the controller switch, whether I control just the entire sound, the sub, the fader, or the center. So here is my main screen, it is the Dell 20, uh, U2412M. Uh, we have a calculator and uh, USB sticks under there. We have my keyboard, the Logitech G710 Plus Mechanical Gaming Keyboard. We have my right screen, the Dell 2009 WT. Uh, and under there we have a bottle opener, <laughs> um, a screwdriver that looks like a pen mixed in with all the other pens and a highlighter and stuff. Uh, there we have my center channel and my webcam, the Logitech C615. And over here we have my right channel and my mouse, the Logitech G502 gaming mouse. Uh, so yeah, right channel, uh, weather station so I can get the temperature of the inside, outside and humidity, time and what the barometric pressure is doing. Uh, over there is my failing external Seagate hard drive that I need to replace. Uh, here is my main computer, so you can't see in there at the moment because I need to get some LED lighting then I'll take the uh, plastic for the side panel off. So uh, in there is a Core i5-4570 uh, CPU with 12 gigabytes of RAM, a GTX 670 for the Win Edition, uh, with the Hyper 212 cooler, the mm, gigabyte, uh, I can't remember the motherboard, uh, the, it'll be in the description. Um, and we also have two 140mm fans, uh, intake and one 120 output. Uh, we also have DVD drive and I'm going to be replacing the SSD in this uh, in the, the, this week. I've uh, ordered it online and, it's, uh, and it was shipped this afternoon. So it's a 240 gig 850 EVO. I have an 840 120 gig EVO in there at the moment. Here is the packaging for my Apple power adapter that I took shipment of today. Uh, I'll show you that soon and why I replaced it. Uh, the box for my fan hub that's also in here and tissues. Ladies. <laughs> uh, under here are some more tools. So these are just a pair of snips and uh, some needle nose pliers, uh, my change jar, uh, headphones and another uh, thing for bits and pieces. Uh, in the bottom here I just have my stash of cables and um, containers for screws. Uh, down there is my rubbish bin and you know rubbish area. Here is my notice board and here is my soldering and uh, project station, that's why I have the overhead camera mount. I jerry-rigged a, uh, a uh, flash bracket onto a microphone thing for on a microphone stand for my um, for my camera for the overhead thing here with the soldering iron and stuff there. Uh, up there is the air conditioner that's on at the moment because it's really hot in here. It was uh, about 26 before I turned it on, it is now 22.4. Uh, light switch, white balance card, um, power board, six gang outlet for this uh, computer that I probably won't use. I'll probably, um, probably, I don't know what I'm going to do with that. Uh, down here, uh, some two way radios, the box for my HVN, box for my microphone, uh, speed computer case. Uh, my computer appear toolkit box thing with um, oh, an envelope. I'm gonna take that with me. Um, and these uh, wire strippers with a set of Allen keys that are a whole lot of screws in there. And there's even more in the shelving unit there. Uh, fire extinguisher. Every need. Uh, every geek needs to have one. Uh, yeah. So this is the uh, holder for my air conditioner remote. Uh, old computer case, dress, uh, fancy dress wear stuff. So yeah, old computer case, it's broken. Door, uh, and draft stop thing. Uh, over here we have a spear torch. There should actually be a mag light down here, but it, I don't know where it's gone. <laughs> um, hand cream, because my job, my hands get really dry. As well as uh, going in and out of air conditioning, so I have the lip balm thingy. Uh, lamp with LED bulb in it, uh, drink uh, water bottle there, uh, cell phone, yeah so cell phone and down here is my 6 outlet power bar with my lamp plugged into it and my power adapter from Apple. I um, decided to get this because um, uh, this makes weird noises 
and also this charged my phone too quickly so I couldn't have it plugged in overnight uh, because it was a 10 watt power adapter and this is only 5 watts uh, this is like 2.1 amps out and what's this should have on it this is 1 amp out 5 watts 1 amp that's 10 watts 2.1 under there is a wireless keyboard and just random crap uh, like that <laughs> and uh, all that sort of stuff there. Um, not really much here really, there's also an outlet over there, uh, a uh, network jack over there. Here's my fire helmet collection which I hope to add to by the end of the year or you know early next year. Uh, here is paperwork, so I have stuff for my bank. Um, some purchase invoice like big purchases. Uh, I also have my Ethernet cables over here uh, and bank statements and stuff around there. I also have my Ethernet cables over here. This is Cat5. Uh, these are just power outlet cables here, so um, C13s, and that's my collection of Cat6 cables there. Um, and over here I have my battery box, my DDR2 and DDR RAM, um, some uh, RJ45s, and some capacitors and there's just old hardware in there as well as a SATA cable <laughs> uh, my cleaning supplies are there as well as a spare computer power supply and my hard drive and SSD collection over there so uh, yeah that is an oh, interesting table with clothes and stuff uh, and oh yeah I forgot to show you over here I still haven't gotten around to putting away those uh, short cat 6 and cat 5 cables which are uh, gonna go obviously over there I forgot to cover, cover my chair this is my current chair I brought it uh, to, uh, two weeks ago and um, yeah it's a really nice chair it is uh, has a five year warranty on it and um, yeah it was two hundred and fifty dollars not bad it came assembled <laughs> And uh, here is the old chair that I just used for over there because it's like the perfect height. So there is the office slash room set up tour for 2016. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you come back next year for next year's tour. So that was the office tour. Like I said, I hope you enjoyed it. It's a simple thing to make and I'll just keep doing it. I've done it for the last three years in a row. Two or three, yeah, three years in a row. This is the third one. Wow. Um, yeah, so I've done it for the last three years in a row and I'll keep making them because they're at one video out of the year that I know I can make and um, they're all around this time uh, so a bit a little bit has changed uh, since last year um, and like I said I'm gonna upgrade my computer here to a 250 gig SSD and that's what's in there at the moment uh, I have only just finished uh, doing that and uh, I've finished making the video as well so I hope you enjoyed the office tour for 2015 it was uh, fun to make uh, Make sure you check out the website www.myplaceinyt.co.nz uh, If you did like this video, give it a like. If you didn't like it, leave a comment saying what I could improve for next time. And uh, also hit subscribe, it really does help me out a lot. Alright, thanks.